I'll give a brief introduction as I said after uh, I graduated in 2021 from NIT Rorkela. I have a graduation B.Tech in Computer Science and Engineering and through campus placement I was placed in Indian Oil Corporation and from October 2021 I have been posted in Indian Oil Refinery Headquarters in Delhi itself. And uh, uh, this was my first attempt and uh, I, I feel too overwhelmed and full of gratitude uh, but I'm still processing this. I might not be very coherent uh, while speaking because uh, it's, it's too new for me as well. I never thought that I'll be speaking about my strategy because I was always doubtful about what I was doing. But I'm really thankful that I was in the right place and right things fell into uh, right place at right time. Uh, so the structure that we would follow is uh, prelims, mains and interview. Along with that, a bit of a backstory is that uh, not to garner any sympathy, but just to be true to my own story. Uh, the last two years of preparation had been extremely difficult on a personal front. Uh, right from uh, December 2021, uh, my mother was uh, diagnosed with stage 4 breast cancer and uh, I lost her last month. So this entire journey had been uh, difficult, not, ju not just for me, but for my mother and she had to go through a lot physically and mentally and in spite of that she was my biggest inspiration, my biggest and my best friend uh, and I had uh, uh, lost my father a couple of years ago so it was extremely daunting uh, on an emotional and mental front. I have been on therapy for two years now and the day before the results came out I had my counselling therapy session as well which is something I will not shy away from accepting because UPSC as a journey becomes too lonely that we tend to push away people and uh, that, that's when you understand the importance of support system. So no matter uh, at what position you are in, keep your support system intact because life gets uglier and it can get more uglier than you can imagine. But I would like to believe there's always light at the end of the tunnel and hope is a very beautiful thing and you need to attach yourself to that beautiful element. 